Hello my beautiful people. Welcome back to another late night pouring episode. Uh, tonight we're going to be working on this beautiful 20 by 24 inch gallery wrap canvas and we're going to be using a black base coat which I haven't done in a while so I'm kind of looking forward to it. Um, I have some beautiful colors with some gorgeous metallic. So tonight we're going to be doing one of our wander ring pours, a wandering ring pour uh, with negative space. This is one of the classes that I am teaching in Fluid Art Boutique in Dublin in 2024. So. I'm very excited. Let's go ahead and get started and I'll show you my colors. So that's a 20 by 24. It's been taped and pinned and I have painted my sides and edges with my base coat color, which is Lent Black from Amsterdam. Okay, the first color we're using tonight is this beautiful Amsterdam Pearl Yellow. My little love affair continues, even though it's kind of on the back burner. But she is a beautiful, beautiful color and it dries so pretty. It's this gorgeous light gold color, which I really, really like. Um, next, we are using Liquitex Turquoise Blue. Very, very pretty color. I really like this one a lot. Leaving a mound on a mound before it melts into itself. My pouring medium is my Golden's, Je Golden's Gel Gloss with Floetrol pouring medium. Uh, you can check out our video called Night of a Thousand Stars to give you a little bit better idea how I mix that pouring medium up. Um, the next one we're using, this is I guess my current little love affair, Pevia Studio Acrylics in Iridescent Green Blue. As opposed to blue green? As opposed to blue green. I have bought the blue green in the past and I love it. And this one is just, it's different. It gives this very, very pretty, metallic, very cool, sparkling effect. This, you know what this color reminds me of is those um, convertible T-birds. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love this. But there's something that really, something very cool happens with that color. I'm going to show you on this piece. But it gets this like really cool... Can you see that like yep. super metallic bling going in there from that and it's specifically from that one paint which I think is just awesome tip so it, tip it up a little bit more there you go you see that like yeah. up in here the blue just like turns electric yep. really really neat stuff so that's from the Pebio that I really really like that one. and we are also using this one started out as the Pebio cadmium yellow but I added a little bit of uh, this one to it, this iridescent orange yellow. So this is a combination of these two. Very pretty. This was a little too yellow and this was a little too orange, so I combined them. And this is kind of going to be my pop color for this piece. And then we also have some Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics in 24 karat gold. Our lovely showgirl. Okay, so that's a 20 by 24. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to layer two cups. We're going to do wandering ring pour across the bottom, but I want to do two separate cups because I want to have one kind of go and move a little bit and I want the other one underneath it. So this should be pretty cool. All right, let's see. We're going to start with a little bit of that pearl yellow in both of them. So that'll be the bottom, the end of our cup. And we're going to go a little bit of gold. Now, important for me in this is I do not want this orangey yellow one to touch that black base coat. So I'm literally going to put this in the middle, sandwiched between <laughs> all four of these other colors. 
Actually, let's go with this turquoise first. Okay. Now I'm going to go with another layer of the pearl yellow. Now I'm going to put some of the green blue in there. Now we're going to come in with that orangey yellow. And a little bit of gold. And now back to the purple yellow. So you'll notice I'm layering these light, dark, light, dark, light, dark. husband of awesomeness. Yes, my love. Je suis prêt. Here we go with our wandering ring pour. Okay, there's one cup. I'm going to start this one kind of down over here. Okay. Ready, honey? I'm actually going to take it over this edge first since we're here and that way I don't have to worry about coming back to that edge and we're going to just walk it down nice and easy some negative space on there but I want to make sure we don't leave too much paint on here so we're going to take that wave over the edge It's 
three. love those colors against the black base. Really, really pretty. I like how they're all popping. That turquoise and the iridescent green blue and the 24 karat gold and that orangey yellow color that we made. And I do see a lot of the pearl yellow in there also. So this is pretty. I think it's going to dry beautifully. I love these lines here where they've opened up. This is really pretty right there. And these lines and in this section here. Pretty cool. Kind of seaweed looking, maybe? I don't know. Also reminds me of a dance, somehow. Let's torch it. It's really pretty and clean and very elegant so I'm very happy with this one um, I will show you guys next time when it is dry thank you so much for hanging out with us tonight um, I will put some video of uh, waves of happiness though dry at the end of this video for you so thank you so much for being here with us tonight love you a lot we'll see you soon bye bye I just wanted to show you the dried results of this one the waves of happiness it came out so beautiful those Pebio studio acrylics are just amazing colors and I love when they are dry there's this gorgeous metallic flash on them which is so pretty especially that iridescent green blue is just amazing in the sunlight I don't know if you guys can see it but it's really really cool looking just very happy with this one I'm trying to keep my shadow out of it sorry really fun stuff on this piece and I love up here at the top that and negative space, the background color, which was mostly the tre faux part treasure gold. Really cool stuff. So this one was awesome. This was waves of happiness. And that blue that you can see like all in here, really, really pretty because it's got that green blue on top of it. So there's this beautiful metallic component to it. that's very sapphire looking, very cool stuff. So this was awesome. This one was waves of happiness. I'll be right back.